Profesa Mishere Gidhai Mugo amesifiwa kama msomi ambaye alichangia pakubwa katika sanaa ya fasihi pamoja na kupigania haki za bin Adam katika hafla ya kumbukumbu iliyoandaliwa kwa heshima yake na chuo kikuu cha Nairobi walokuwepo walimsifu profesa kama mwandishi aliyezungumzia na kupinga ukiukaji wa haki za bin Adam Profesa Mishere Mugo alifariki tarehe 30 Juni nchini Marekani akiwa na umri wa miaka 81 Ukumbi wa taifa wa chuo kikuu cha Nairobi ulikuwa na mkutano wa kipekee hafla maalum iliyowaleta pamoja wasomi tajika nchini Kenya kitengo cha fasihi katika chuo hicho kiliandaa hafla ya kumbukumbu ya profesa Mishere Gidhai Mugo ambaye aliwahi kuwa mhathiri na baadaye mkuu wa kitivo cha sanaa na kila aliyezungumza alimsifu katika kazi yake ya uhadhiri uandishi wa vitabu na utetezi wa haki za binadamu that even those of us who were never directly taught by her uh, still feel her influence i personally was taught by lecturers and teachers who were taught by professor uh, michere gidai mogo that although thousands of miles away professor michere was working with social justice centers here in nairobi I felt so challenged. Marehemu Profesa Mugo alikuwa mwanamke wa kwanza nchini kuchaguliwa mkuu wa kitivo cha sanaa katika chuo kikuu cha Nairobi. Ukosoaji wake wa serikali ulisababisha ondoke nchini mwaka 1982. Licha ya masaibu yaliyomkumba, alianzisha mpango wa kuwasaidia wanafunzi kutoka jamii maskini kuendelea na masomo yao. Family of the late Professor Michele Mugo established a bursary fund called the Jerry Global Children's Award which seeks to support Kenyans uh, who are from uh, disadvantaged backgrounds but are bright to be able to access uh, uh, university education and even basic education. The more things change, the more they remain the same. So. Uh, We must pay tribute to people like Michele Mugo for what they've done in our country. Very committed and dedicated to the cause of emancipation of our society. Mpenzi wa sanaa, Profesa Mugo pia alikuwa mwandishi mahiri, aliandika na kuhariri vitabu 15. Na katika hafla hii ya ukumbusho, wasomi wenzake walitunga shairi kumwenzi. When you meet Wangare Mathai, let her know the struggle for the an ecologically safe Kenya and the planet continues. Where my motherland buries our heroes alive, stubborn survivors and mourned and decorated and remembered, shadow people dying installment death. Familia yake inokumbuka upole na karimu wake kwa watu wote. She was very confident in everything which she did. Very hard working courageous brave and this would be evident as we have seen and will hear in her later life she was a fighter she stood her ground when she knew that she was speaking the truth or when she was speaking for the less fortunate members of the society Profesa Mishere Gidhai Mugo alifariki Jumaa Juni tarehe 30 akiwa na umri wa miaka 81 baada ya kuugua saratani kwa muda. Hadi kifo chake alikuwa mhadhiri wa fasihi katika chuo kikuu cha Syracuse Marekani na alijulikana sana kwa juhudi zake za kutetea haki za binadamu. Mary Mwoki, Runinga, Citizen.